Hey guys, welcome back to a, another Warframe Builds video. This time we'll be looking at the Haiku Prime, which is one of the better stealth secondaries in the game. Um, I would say this is mostly, I use this mostly in spy missions and it, it's not as good. It doesn't have the power of stuff like the Vakor Merlock or the Sinoid Gamma Core or Ak Bronto Prime or like those sorts of weapons. However, in my opinion, it is the best stealth weapon, just for utility. Um, the build I have on it is a status build because its crit chance is terrible. It's got 2.5% crit chance. Uh, most of its damage comes from puncture, so I've modded that out as well. So for this build, uh, I have Hornet Strike, obviously for damage, and then I've got Lethal Torrent and Barrel Diffusion for multi-shot. Uh, Lethal Torrent also adds a bit of fire rate, which is great for this weapon because it fires ridiculously quickly. It's great. I love it. Um, and then I've got to increase the puncture damage. I've got bore and no return. Uh, depending on how you're using this weapon, you could swap no return out for a ammo mutation mod. Uh, I'm not sure if I've got one leveled up. But, no I don't. But if you wanted to put an ammo mutation mod on there instead, I could definitely see arguments for that just because of like how much ammo this thing burns through due to its fire rate. Um, yeah, so maybe swap that out. But if you're going using how I'm using it in sorties, doing like spy missions, using it to stealth kill things, speed run with Loki through, make sure you hit all the doors and whatever, um, no returns fine. And then I've got uh, my dual stat mods. So I've got Jolt for electricity and status chance, Frostbite for cold and status chance, and Pistol Pestilence for toxin and status chance. Uh, this way around that I've got it now will give you toxin and magnetic, which is my personal favorite. But there's also um, uh, freaking electricity and viral this way around, or uh, corrosive and cold like that so they're both viable things this brings the status chance up to 78.2% which is like you proc a status when you throw it because you'll you, it, it fires so quickly that you're guaranteed to proc those status chance those status things um, so that's always good so you get that toxin and that magnetic to tear down shields and poison, which is good. Also, you can go for viral and half the health. It's you can swap around depending on what faction you're fighting. Um, I would definitely say this weapon does lack power compared to, say, a Vakor Merlock. But utility-wise, it's fantastic. As you, everyone knows, when you're running through a spy mission with Loki, you see the yellow doors, and you go through them, and you just lose your energy, and you're like, well, shit. I love using Haiku Prime to spam like stars at the top of the door. It's great. It gets rid of that easy. It kills surprisingly fast just because of how fast it fires. But you do need to be careful that you don't burn through all the ammo. The other side note for this is actually it's fantastic for, um, for messing around in jewel, in the jewel arenas and in conclave. Uh, I'll put some clips at the end of me just messing around with this build um, in the jewel arenas in our dojo. It's great. Other than that, thanks for watching this shorter episode of Warframe Builds. Uh, I hope it's helpful. I, I hope you can use this weapon. And I will see you next time. Excellent. You have defeated your challenge.